While the earliest hominid or human-like species first appeared around 2 million years ago, early Homo sapiens, or modern humans, are relatively young. They first appeared in Africa around 200,000 years ago. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. For thousands of years after Homo sapiens first appeared, early man laid the foundations for what would eventually become human civilization by developing agriculture, weaponry, art, social structure, and politics. Before we dive in further, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Although the Mesopotamians are typically considered the very first urban civilization in the world, several earlier peoples developed complex societies and cultures that could also be classified as civilizations, and they have been included on this list. 10. Akkadian Empire The Akkadian Empire is often called the world's first empire. The empire united Akkadian and Sumerian speakers under one rule, and their civilization stretched across Mesopotamia, the Levant, and Anatolia, modern-day Iraq, Syria, and Turkey. Since the empire combined two distinct yet similar civilizations, its people were bilingual, speaking both Sumerian and Akkadian, and writing in the Akkadian version of cuneiform. The Akkadians regularly traded with the nearby Indus Valley civilization. The Sumerians and Akkadians had a surplus of agricultural products, which they traded for metal ores, timber, and building stone. The people of the Akkadian Empire were skilled craftsmen and made a number of beautifully carved seals and cast metal statues. 9. Ancient Egyptians Ancient Egyptian civilization is traditionally stated to have started around 3150 BCE, when King Menes unified Upper and Lower Egypt and established a capital city at White Walls, later called Memphis. Egyptians are perhaps the most well-known of the ancient civilizations. While they made several social, cultural, and political advancements, they are best known for creating the Great Pyramids, which have stood the test of time and remain one of the great wonders of the world. The ancient Egyptians developed construction techniques that enabled them to build massive monuments such as pyramids, temples, and obelisks. Some of their other achievements include creating a system of mathematics, a practical and effective system of medicine, irrigation systems, the first known planked boats, glass technology, and new forms of literature. Egyptian culture left a lasting legacy on the world and many things we use today were first developed by the ancient Egyptians, such as mints, paper, door locks, alarm clocks, concrete, and much more. 8. Indus Valley Civilization The Indus Valley Civilization, or Harappan Civilization, was the first urban civilization in South Asia, modern-day Pakistan, and northwest India. The Harappans built numerous sprawling cities, which were notable for their urban planning, water supply systems, elaborate drainage systems, and large concentrations on non-residential buildings. The people of the Indus Valley also developed a number of technologies, including one of the world's first systems of uniform weights and measures. They also created new techniques in metallurgy and produced copper, bronze, lead, and tin. In addition to math and engineering, the Indus Valley civilization enjoyed a number of arts and crafts. Various games and toys have also been found in Indus Valley civilization cities. 7. Norte Chico The Norte Chico civilization, also called Corral or Corral Supe civilization, is considered to be the oldest known civilization that existed in the Americas. The formation of the civilization's first city happened around 3500 BCE, and from this time until a period of decline around 1800 BCE, the Norte Chico people flourished. The Norte Chico civilization is a pre-ceramic culture as archaeologists have found no ceramic remains and almost no visual art. However, the Norte Chico people are known for their monumental architecture, which includes large earthwork platform mounds and sunken circular plazas. 6. Mesopotamia Around 10,000 BCE, some of the first fully developed Neolithic cultures began to settle in the Fertile Crescent, which includes Mesopotamia. Around 8,000 BCE, people in northern Mesopotamia began to cultivate barley and wheat, which they used to make beer, gruel, soup, and eventually bread. During the time known as the Ubad period, circa 6500 to 3800 BCE, the earliest signs of civilization began, as agriculture and animal husbandry were widely practiced in sedentary communities. This gave rise to the Sumerians, who are credited as the first urban civilization in the world. The Sumerians were the first to develop trade and establish industries such as weaving, leatherwork, metalwork, masonry, and pottery. One of the greatest achievements of ancient Mesopotamia was the invention of the wheel sometime around 3500 BCE. Evidence suggests that they were first used for making pottery and not for transportation. 5. Jaihu Jaihu was a settlement located on the central plain of ancient China, and the people who lived there developed some of the earliest aspects of Chinese culture. 
The Jaihu culture is often mentioned with the Pelagang culture, as archaeologists cannot agree whether or not the Jaihu people were a part of the larger group of Pelagang. However, there is evidence that they were two separate cultures that developed around the same time. For example, the people of Jaihu cultivated rice while the Pelagang did not, and the Jaihu settlement existed for several hundred years before the first Pelagang settlements popped up. The Jaihu are also known for producing the world's oldest wine, and perhaps the earliest playable music. Lots of flutes have been found at Jaihu, and perhaps the earliest example of Chinese writing. The Jaihu symbols are 16 distinct markings found on prehistoric artifacts, and are believed to have been indicative of sign usage rather than systematic writing. 4. Ain Ghazal Ain Ghazal was an early farming community and its people are known for creating some of the earliest statues of the human form. The figures are made out of plaster and consist of full statues and busts that depict men, women, and children. A total of 15 statues and 15 busts were found in two separate caches, separated by about 200 years. In addition to creating the statues, the people of Ain Ghazal were farmers who domesticated wheat, barley, peas, lentils, and chickpeas. They also hunted wild animals such as gazelle, deer, pigs, foxes, and hares. For the time period, the people of An Gazelle ate a wide variety of food. 3. Katalhuyuk The settlement of Katalhuyuk is one of the oldest urban settlements and one of the most well-preserved Neolithic settlements. Excavations of the site have revealed evidence of prehistoric social organization and cultural practices. The people of Katahayuk were one of the earliest people to adopt a sedentary life and practice agriculture. It is estimated that the average population of Katahayuk was between 5,000 to 7,000. The settlement has no streets or footpaths. Instead, the houses were clustered together with roof access. There is also evidence that the people of Katahayuk kept their living spaces clean and disposed of their sewage and food in an area outside of the ruins of the settlement. The people of Katalhuyuk also buried their dead, painted murals, sculpted figurines, and even plastered and painted skulls to recreate faces. 2. Aboriginal Australians Although the people who settled in Mesopotamia are often credited as the first civilization, new research shows that Aboriginal Australians are one of the oldest known civilizations on Earth. The Aborigines can trace their ancestries back to about 75,000 years ago, but became a distinct genetic group around 50,000 years ago. It is believed that this ancient group of Aboriginal Australians first settled in Australia between 40,000 and 31,000 years ago. They are the direct ancestors of today's remaining Aboriginal tribes and their culture has largely remained the same. The discovery of the human remains from Lake Mungo in New South Wales, Australia in 1969 show signs of being one of the oldest known cremations. The remains, which are known as the Mungo Woman, have been dated to about 24,700 to 19,030 years ago. 1. Sand People The Sand People of Southern Africa trace their history directly to ancient peoples who lived around 140,000 to 100,000 years ago. In fact, the San are the direct descendants of one of the original ancestral human groups, Haplogroup, making the San the oldest civilization in the world. In the past, the San were semi-nomadic hunter-gatherers, but today many San work as farm laborers, run nature conservancies, and other various small jobs as hunting and gathering alone is no longer sustainable. Recent archaeological finds have uncovered the oldest known ritual ceremonies, which have been attributed to the San. Archaeologists discovered 70,000-year-old spearheads in a cave in Sosido Hills of Botswana that were sacrificed to the python. The Solido Hills are also notable for being the site of the world's largest concentration of rock paintings. This art was also made by ancient sand people. That was all from us today for this video, folks. See you in the next one.